Hey there! Looking for new games for 2025 for your Switch? Then you're in the right place. We've already started the video Pokemon Legends ZA, the highly anticipated sequel to Pokemon Legends Arceus, which promises to take players on a new adventure in the Sinnoh region. The story takes place in a distant past, before the formation of the Sinnoh region as we know it. The region is in a wild and unexplored state, with Pokemon living freely and interacting with nature. The expectation is that the game will bring new mechanics and an innovative gaming experience. Next up is Star Wars Episode I Jedi Power Battles, an action game set in the Star Wars universe, specifically during the events of Star Wars Episode I The Phantom Menace. Originally released in 2000 for PlayStation 1 and Dreamcast, the game stands out as a 3D beat-em-up, allowing players to take on the roles of various Jedi. The game is known for its cooperative gameplay, allowing two players to join forces to face enemies and progress through levels based on the movie's narrative. Donkey Kong Country Returns HD is a remaster of the classic platformer game originally released for the Nintendo Wii in 2010. In the game, players help Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong recover their precious banana hoard, which was stolen by enemies. The gameplay retains the essence of the original, with challenging levels and a variety of mechanics including jumps, races, and combat against enemies. The HD version not only brings improved graphics, but also includes additional stages introduced in the Nintendo 3DS version. This promises to offer a richer and more diverse experience for players, while taking advantage of the Switch's graphical capabilities. Quizineer is a charming game that combines dungeon exploration elements with roguelite mechanics, where players take on the role of Palm, a young adventurer who becomes the owner of a restaurant. The game is set in Palm's hometown, Pyle, which she returns to manage after finding her parents' restaurant closed and sunk in debt. In Quizineer, players explore a world full of diverse creatures. The gameplay involves defeating monsters using a spatula and bubble tea, collecting ingredients, and then cooking and serving dishes in the restaurant. Phantom Breaker Battlegrounds Ultimate is the definitive version of the classic fighting game Phantom Breaker Battlegrounds with enhanced graphics, improved gameplay mechanics, and a range of new features. The game is a side-scrolling beat-em-up with a focus on anime action and pixel art, featuring online multiplayer support for up to eight players and all characters from previous versions of Phantom Breaker Battlegrounds and Overdrive. The game has been rebuilt from the ground up in Unreal Engine 5, providing smoother gameplay and more flashy special attacks. Atelier Resleriana, The Red Alchemist and the White Guardian is a new title in the Atelier series, developed by Gust and published by Koei Tecmo. 
This game is an offline spin-off of the franchise's latest mobile game. Unlike many modern games that rely on online connections, Atelier Rislariana will be a completely offline experience, allowing players to enjoy the story without the need to be connected to the internet. As is typical of the Atelier series, the game will include RPG elements focused on alchemy, where players can collect ingredients and create items. It's about the spirit. Huh? Oh, you're... Uh... Your name was Shally, right? Yes, I'm Shalistera. Oh, I'm Shally. Shally, short for Shallot. And Shalistera. Biped 2 is the sequel to the popular game Biped, known for its cooperative gameplay and physics-based mechanics. The original game involved two bipedal robots, Aku and Sila, who needed to work together on an exciting adventure. The new version promises to expand on this experience, bringing new mechanics and challenges. The game maintains a focus on cooperation, allowing up to four players to play together. This promises to increase the fun and complexity of player interactions. Players will be able to explore an unknown planet and experience new gameplay mechanics, both in solo and cooperative modes. Capcom Fighting Collection 2 is a highly anticipated compilation of eight classic arcade fighting games from Capcom, set to be released in 2025. The collection will feature eight classic games, including iconic titles like Capcom vs. SNK2, Mark of the Millennium 2001, and Project Justice. In addition to these, the collection will include other fighting games and brawlers that have made their mark. The anticipation surrounding the release is high especially among fans of fighting games from the 90s and 2000s. Capcom has a strong history in this genre, and the inclusion of titles like Street Fighter Alpha 3 and other classics promises to attract both new players and veterans. The new game from the famous thief Carmen Sandiego is set to be released in 2025 and promises to bring an innovative experience to fans of the franchise. One of the big novelties of this game is that players will be able to take control of Carmen Sandiego for the first time. This represents a significant change as in previous versions, players usually acted as detectives trying to capture her. The new game will be a mix of adventure and puzzle, allowing players to explore different locations around the world while solving challenges and mysteries. Constance is a 2D hand-drawn action-adventure game known for its engaging narrative and unique aesthetic. The game puts the player in the shoes of an artist who uses a brush as a weapon, fighting to escape from an internal world that is both colorful and deteriorating, reflecting her declining mental health. The game is classified as a Metroidvania, combining elements of exploration and skill progression, allowing players to discover new areas as they advance in the story. Discounty is a management simulation RPG that puts you in the role of a supermarket manager, challenging you to revitalize a declining business while also reviving a forgotten community. 
Developed by Crinkle Cut Games, a Danish studio founded in 2021, the game promises a relaxing and quirky experience, with a touch of satire and subversion. The game is set in Blomkest, a decaying port town with a declining population. Your task is to take over the town's only grocery store, this county, and turn it into a thriving business. Sid Meier's Civilization VII is the next title in the renowned turn-based strategy game series developed by Firaxis Games. One of the main innovations of the game is the division between leaders and civilizations, allowing players to experience crises and declines throughout history, giving control to different peoples in various eras. This approach can offer a new gameplay dynamic, where decisions and historical events directly impact gameplay. The combination of classic elements with new mechanics can revitalize the experience of building civilizations, maintaining the essence that made the franchise a landmark in strategy games. We've reached the end of the list, thank you for watching, and if you want to support the channel even more, consider becoming a member and have access to exclusive videos. I'm out for now and until next time.